Oh my god, their singing is so bad. Hey everyone, Anthony here, and welcome back to part 14 of my Casual Sims 3 LP. So, in the last part, it was basically the rebrand of Rhea. We moved into a wonderful new house, and she also got a little bit of a makeover, which basically is just re representing a new time in her life where she is going to literally just girl boss. That's literally the only way I can put it. She also joined the um, uh, detective career, investigator career, I mean, and she is now an investigator because I think what would happen with her with Alexi just shook her up so much that, like, she doesn't know who she can trust and she wants to help others who also are going through the same stuff with them not being able to know what's going on with the people around them. So basically, she's just solving cases to see what the townspeople are really like. But anywho, it is Tuesday morning, and she is taking care of Aiden first thing in this morning. Um, she actually has a thing she needs to... It's from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. So when it turns 8 a.m., she's definitely going to go ahead and do that. Um, ooh, Unrideable Sim, have fun. So he's going to go ahead and eat some food, and she's going to go ahead and eat some herself while he's eating. Um, go ahead and just have a cheesesteak for breakfast, to be honest. I'm too lazy for her to make... Um, some breakfast this morning. Ugh, I just love how bright this house is. It just makes me so happy, but he's just eating his food. Love that for him. She's going to go ahead and have her cheesesteak this morning. And in this part, I don't really have much of a plan. She's just going to go ahead and do some cases today. And another really big thing that she needs to do is she needs to completely cut it off with Lola because it still says they're good friends, and I don't like that. She should not be good friends with her. Um, oops, now I'm going to do that. And let's go ahead and put Aiden in his walker so he can learn how to walk today while the babysitter's here. I think that would be pretty useful. So... Um, so he can be a little well-rounded so he can pick his next trait because he's evil, which I did say their divorce would be um, his villain origin story, so keep that in mind. So he's going to go ahead and help the investigation. He's going to go ahead and just learn how to walk, so... We have so much money left over, it's literally insane. I think I should buy her a car, but I'm going to have to figure out where I can put that. Maybe I can put, like, a carport right here because we have 62,000 simoleons. That's literally insane, but, um... Call babysitter. You know what? Actually, I wanted to buy her a bike since she's eco-friendly, and that's a, like a little change of things because I usually always have my Sims have cars. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy her a cute little bike. Cause why not? Oh, that's actually crazy. <laughs> it's gonna be so funny to see her go around town in this bike. One second. Let me make it. I'll make it pink. Cause why not? And the seat can be white as well as the wheels. But yeah, that taxi really quickly, girl. Get out of the taxi. Go with your bike. Oh, this is crazy. Okay. Um, you know, as long as she's having fun, good for her. Good for her, but... Oh, this bike is so slow. Oh, this is crazy. This is actually so funny. She's literally going across all of Saffron Bay on a bike. Also, please excuse the lag. Honestly, I think this world is literally just too much for my computer to handle at times, so... Please excuse that, but she's gonna go ahead. She's going over the whole bridge in a bicycle. That is actually too funny. Uh, oh, Rhea, see, I'm finally I'm finally going to your eco-friendly tray. I always make you go in a car, but look, see? She's so happy. She's saving the environment. Why commute in a gas-guzzling automobile when a bike has zero emissions and is so stylish? You tell him, Queen. Look, her bike's literally on, like, the little bike stand right here. That is so funny. But after she's done with that... Oh, he learned how to walk. That's awesome. Oh, she wants to see Aiden age up well. I'll lock that in. And then, why don't she go ahead and obtain a case while she's here? Can she do that? from here can't she just I think she has to wait until she gets a call for her to be able to get a case but I thought you could just obtain one hmm maybe I'm wrong she's just helping this investigation um oh okay okay cute script error we love that yes okay well um, I guess something's wrong with helping that investigation so I'm just gonna get rid of that I guess that's actually annoying but anywho can we like get oh my god wait did I put a desk with a computer in this house anywhere what is wrong with me? I really forgot a desk with a computer. Let me go ahead and buy one really quickly. I swear I put one in this house. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess I'll put it, like, right here. Um, this is a little bit of a weird area, actually. Maybe, like, right here. Ow, how did I forget a desk with a computer? I've been in build mode more than I've actually played the game today. Please do not mind me. Well, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and put it in this room for now, because this will be for a future child, which I forgot to even mention... But in this part, I did add her future love interest, so we'll see if she possibly meets him in this part. Obviously, I think she's going to go very slow, as she's kind of traumatized with what happened with her and um, uh, Alexi. So obviously, they won't move super fast, but I did just want to make that clear. He is in the town, so 
We'll see if we see him out and about, and she's also going to start going on the online dating thing just to see if she can see anyone in the town. Because why not? Oops, did I mean to do that? Ugh, don't mind me. I just know this part's so fun so far, guys, right? I'm sure you guys love this part. Okay, go ahead and do that. And we can get an expensive computer because we're literally so rich. We're going to get her a whole, like, this whole thing. Is this is this even functional? This doesn't look functional. Let's, what's this? Yeah, we'll get her that. And then let's just put, like, a little plant. Oh, this is cute. Yes. And, like, let's do, like, a little um, lamp or something. Um, oh, wow, that's a huge lamp. Let's do, like, a candle or something. Oh, yes, that's cute. Okay, cool. And I'll, I'll furnish this room more later. I just really want to get her a computer, so... Uh, oh, she can search for an investigator case here. Let's go ahead and do that. We'll also go ahead and have her look for some profiles in the online dating thing. Oh, he needs help. You know what? I'll, I'll take care of you in a second. Don't worry. Kind of forgot we had a kid for a second, but... Let's see. Let's go ahead and obtain a case. So... Um, Susanna Wells wants me to dig up some low-level dirt on someone. Before I get too deep in the case, I should check out with Susanna Wells for details that we cannot discuss over the phone. Okay, and let's go ahead and browse some profiles and check our messages, because we honestly haven't checked this since we married, um, uh, Alexi, but since we're divorced now, um, oh, this is the sim I created for her. Oh my god, that's so funny that he's on- oh, not Alexi on the online dating profile. I hate you, Alexi. But anywho, this is actually the sim I made for her. This is kind of a little bit of a spoiler, but isn't he fine? His name is Andrea, and his traits are born salesman, green thumb, loves the cold, natural cook, and neat. Those are his favorites, so we'll go ahead and definitely send him a message. Wow. That's like perfect timing, to be honest. But yeah, she's gonna go ahead and send that message and check hers. Um, you sound like a lot of fun. Clark, Ryan. Okay, you're old. Uh, no thanks. Joel looks okay. Carrie looks okay, and Toby looks okay. So let's go ahead and take care of our kid, I guess. Let's go ahead and um, pick him up. And then we'll go ahead and report in for this case. Bruh. Bro, can you get over here? Pick him up. There you go. Go ahead and um, change his dirty diaper, attack him with the claw, tickle him, then put him in his crib, and we're going to go ahead and report in for this case, because we need to. Um, I was like, who is this thing? She's kind of ugly, but anywho. We're going to go ahead and report in for this case. Um, and also, like I said, I still want to talk to Lola later today so we can like full-on say, like, girl, we're done. We can't be friends anymore, because honestly, it should be known by now, but like, oh, she's like literally right here. Oh, is this her house or something, or is this a specific... Girl, report in. Where is she? She's right here. Okay, Susanna Wells. Let's go ahead and see. Um, oh, okay. Um, Susanna Wells is convinced Susan N Nelson works for a small criminal organization in town. Evidence is required before Susanna can conduct a citizen's arrest. I shouldn't expect the mail and search through the garbage at Susanna Nelson's home. Got it. I think we literally got promoted. Oh, that's awesome. We have been now conferred the title of Small Claims Investigator by the Town Council. That's awesome. So, oh, her house is literally right here. Okay. Didn't we... If I recall, didn't we do... Or no, maybe it was... I forgot which house it was. I don't think it was this house, actually. But let's go ahead and inspect her mail for clues as well as her trash really quickly. Oh, she's in her little investigator gear. Okay, queen. Yes. Let's go ahead and just take a photo of that really quickly. Um, The sunlight's doing her a little dirty, but... Anywho, let's go ahead and search through her stuff. Oh, there's a baby in there. Oh, are they home? That's awkward. Hopefully they don't see us. Um, she found some CD information. We can use it to blackmail her, but honestly, I don't care too much about the blackmail right now. Okay, come on, girl. Search the garbage. Oh, was she just outside? Um, uh, aha, based on the notes in this discarded diary, Susan Nelson is an aspiring crony in the local crime syndicate. Okay, so let's go ahead and report our findings. And then after this, if the case is done, we're definitely going to go ahead and um, go head over to Lola and just tell her what's good. Um, oh, okay, she's here at the library. Oh, someone just died? Okay. Oh, okay, in honor of solving three cases, the mayor would like to reward you with the investigator's trophy of honor. Oh, okay. So she's happy. We got job experience and 500 simoleons. Um, she's hungry, so let's go ahead and buy her a brownie really quickly. She's going to eat it in her little investigator gear. Actually, I want her to change. And after she's done eating this brownie because she's a little hungry, we'll go ahead and head over to Lola and just be like, Girl, it's over. Like, you should know that we don't want to be friends anymore. Oh, wow, she ages up in two days already. Jeez. She's going to go ahead and eat her brownie. And just take a photo. She looks so happy to be eating this brownie. Look. She's like, I, I have been waiting for this brownie all day. It's like her little reward for getting her little 
um, case done, but she's gonna go ahead and eat that brownie. Okay, um, let's go ahead and see if Lola's home. She's out at the park. Well, we're literally gonna invite her out. Uh, we actually will invite her right to the Java Hood. She's gonna be thinking like, wow, besties, they're gonna go out and have a good time. No, we're literally about- She's not interested. Girl, you know what? We're gonna send her, like, a bunch of insulting texts, because she doesn't even have the audacity to come sa face us. Like, that's insane. Send her a bunch of insulting texts. Like, that's crazy. Anywho. You know what? She wants to solve another case. Let's head out on the town tonight. It's like 6 p.m., so it's still pretty early. Let's go to a club or something. Rhea hasn't been clubbing since literally her Bridgeport days, so... Um, she can also get her trophy. I'll have her do that tomorrow, though. Um, don't mind my game um, lagging so bad. Let's head to... Huh. Maybe the... I don't know. There's so many places to choose from. The Techno Wave Lounge. We'll head there. See if we meet anyone tonight. Maybe we can meet Mr. Andrea. She was sending her a bunch of insulting texts. So now we're down to friends. But I'll make sure to make um, their relationship worse. Because, oh my god, it's killing me that she's going everywhere on a bike. Um, how's Aiden doing over here? Is the babysitter taking care of him? Siobhan? Yeah, she's doing pretty okay. He's pretty... Oh, I can't speak English. He's doing pretty okay right now. I honestly think Aiden's going to feel like neglected during his childhood. Because I feel like Rhea's going to be out like solving cases. And like not really paying much attention as much as she should to him. So let's just keep that in mind. Like I said... Oh, we just got ran over. Cute. Um, he is evil. So, you know, he's definitely going to be different to what my usual sim kids are like. Like, I... I rarely play sims that are truly, truly bad, and I think he's gonna be one of them, so. Ooh, we're here. Oh, okay, this place kinda serves. <gasps> oh my god, he's here. Oh my god, he's here. This is literally perfect. Look who's here. It's Mr. Andrea Mendez. I need you guys to look at him, because he's so fine. Oh my god, wait. Where is he? Where is he? He is right here. This is Mr. Andrea Mendez. Larry, look at how fine this man is. Tell me he's not literally the finest man you have ever seen. Oh my god, let's go introduce ourselves. Quick. His, let's just say that she saw him as she walked in. She was it, like, he really caught her eye. So he's going to go ahead and introduce... Or, I can't speak English. She's going to go ahead and introduce herself. Oh my god. This is literally perfect. Oh my god, wait. I just need to get a good angle of their first meet. Oh my gosh, they met each other. I hope they're attracted to each other. Oh my god, yes they are. I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. This is awesome. Yes, okay. Dang, they're already almost friends. Let's go ahead. Let's announce our promotion. Get to know him. Ask about his career. Um, go ahead and high-five him. Oh my god, I am so happy they met each other. Oh, he said it's fun getting to know you. This is crazy. I need to take a bunch of photos. Just give me a second. Oh, this is so... Oh my god. This is amazing. I am so, so happy that they met each other. Oh, they're just talking to each other. I think they're hitting it off really well, too. Yes, this is awesome. I'm so glad that they met each other, actually, in this part. I don't think they would, to be honest, but... They're just going to go ahead and talk with each other. Hopefully they can become friends tonight, actually. Oh, so he's in the business career. He's a division manager, which I did set myself. Oh my god, can they can they do karaoke together? Everyone, get off of this. How can I stop them? Let's... I really want them to... I guess we'll watch, but I want them to sing together. Not her booing them. That's crazy. Uh, she already wants to mute a few simoleons off of him. No, he's going to be your future man. Okay, let's sing with him. Go ahead and sing with Andrea. Oh, this is crazy. Oh my god, they're gonna sing together. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait, okay. I need to get a good angle of this. Okay. He's so fine, y'all. Y'all, tell me y'all don't see it. Oh, oh my god. This is crazy. Oh, um. So, I actually don't hear anything. Oh, oh, there it is. Um. Ooh. Oh, um. Oh, their singing is so atrocious. Oh my god, their singing is so bad. But okay, they look so cute together, though. Aw, this is so cute. Okay, that's enough. Please stop. Y'all are actually hurting my ears. Um, No, actually, stop, y'all. I'm serious. Please stop. <laughs> Let's go ahead and just do a few more things. Let's go ahead. Let's honestly dance together for a little bit. She had, like, literally no drinks tonight, but... Aw, okay. Guys, I hope you guys like him as much as I do, but I think she will be a really good like, new person for Rhea after Alexi. So, y'all can let me know what you think of him, but, oh, okay, they're getting it down. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, okay. See, she's, like, out partying till almost 12 while he's literally still home all by himself. I feel so bad. But we're gonna go ahead and go ahead and head home now. I think it's time. She's, like, pretty tired, so... 
she's gonna go ahead and head home. You guys can let me know what you think of Mr. Andrea. Look at how fine he is, y'all. Oh, where's my camera? Where's my camera? Oh, there he is. Okay. Look at how fine he is. He is fine. Like, and I think, honestly, from this point going forward, um, Aiden, like I said, he's gonna feel very left out when he gets older, because in my head, like, this is very far down, like, the line, but in my head, she's gonna marry Andrea one day, and they're gonna have a kid, and he's gonna feel like he's not wanted in this family and stuff, and he's gonna cause a bunch of fights with everyone, be very rebellious, get into a lot of trouble. So, let's go ahead and, um, where is, do we, what happened to the babysitter? We need to take care of our kid. Let's go ahead and change his diaper. Um, go ahead and change his diaper. And he's a little hungry, so let's go ahead and put him in his high chair. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and skip into the morning. Good morning, y'all. So it is Wednesday morning. Um, Aiden doesn't really need anything now, so she's gonna go ahead and take a quick shower and make herself some breakfast. She'll make some organic waffles. And during the night, look what I noticed. Mr. Alexi is now an elder. He has pigtails and all, so I just think that's really funny. I will go ahead and give him a makeover in the next part, because even though he's not with Rhea anymore, my family tree needs to look cute, so. Um, what is she wearing? She's wearing her outerwear? Girl, you're inside. No comment. Um, oh, Susanna Wilson's unroutable. Cute. Love that. I think I need to go ahead and do a reset town thing in a, in a um, few parts or so, because the town's low-key going a little crazy, so. Um, dang, she's in a really bad mood. Eat your waffles, girl. Um, they're normal quality. They're not even that yummy. She's gonna go ahead and eat them at her. Oh, someone's calling us. Let's go ahead and answer that really quickly. Then she can go ahead and finish her waffles. Um, Selena? No, we can't chat right now. I'm sorry. I don't feel like chatting with her right now. She's gonna go ahead and eat. And she's gonna go ahead and send a friendly text to Andre and just say that, like, he really, like, made her feel good after a while. Like, she hasn't had a good night since last night. So, uh, oh, she got the social networking skill. And then, while she's feeling good this morning and... He's still sleeping. She's going to go ahead and continue her business degree because I do think in the long run I would want her to go into the business career, but I don't know. I'm just, I just want her to continue her degree. I feel like it would be cool if she had a degree to herself and we have so much money, so I think it would be nice for her to have a degree. So she's just going to do that this morning until Mr. Aiden needs some help. Well, not help, but just like needs his needs taken care of. He's like not close with his parents at all. Um, I did say Alexi would never see his kid again, but honestly, maybe we'll invite him over in the next few parts, because I think even when Aiden gets older, to be honest, um, oh, she's not having fun anymore, so let's go ahead and take care of him. Um, even when Aiden gets older, if Alexi makes it, to be honest, if he makes it to when Aiden is a teen, I think he's going to prefer being with his dad more than his mom, so let's go ahead and give him some food. Go ahead and give him some baby food. Why don't you use the bathroom and then... Send another text to Andrea today. And we'll send a few insulting texts to um, Lola as well, so. Yes, perfect. Um, how's he doing? Okay. Oh, good. We're not friends anymore. That's exactly what I wanted, so. That's what she deserves. Um, let's go ahead and also get a playpen. Um, we don't have any room for a playpen, actually, do we? Okay, just kidding. We're not getting a playpen. Because I want him to learn how to talk, but... Oh well, let's go ahead and pick him up and potty train him once, really quickly. Go ahead and mm, potty train him. And then we'll just put him back in his crib, and let's go ahead and see if we can get a case today. Or maybe we'll just go ahead and do some low-level police work so we can get that trophy anyway that we get for completing three cases, so... Let's go ahead and head here. Oh my gosh, my game is so laggy in this world, I might honestly need to move her, because... Let me know what y'all would think if I moved towns, but I kept the same house. Because honestly, my game is so laggy. Okay, but anywho. She's going to go ahead and collect her service reward. And then she's also going to do some low-level police work today. So, yes. Let's go ahead and do that. Once again, she's leaving Aiden at home. I'm so sorry, Aiden. Like, you honestly deserve better, but... Um, little does he know, he's going to grow up to be a menace to society. So, anywho. Why is she, like, wobbling? Anywho. Go ahead, go on on your bike, queen. Yep. Um, obviously, we're gonna call a babysitter. Um, this taxi... Oh, I thought this taxi has been here, like, literally since night. Oh, look who just got home, Lola. I'm honestly wondering if him, or if her and, um, Alexia will get together. But I actually have story progression turned off in this save, so maybe I should turn it on, but... Um, um, why does it still say two? She should be at one. Hello. Love when the Sims game does that. I always fix it, though. Did his go up correctly? Let's see. Yes, his went up correctly. Okay, he has four days until he becomes a kid, which honestly, I'm ready for him to become a kid, so... 
She's going to go ahead and get this award and do some low-level police work. She can either do business as usual, crank out paperwork, meet cops, um, pal around. Let's go ahead and have her do perform feats of logic. She's going to go ahead and collect a service reward. Greetings, Rhea. It is my honor to reward you with the Investigator's Trophy of Honor in, recogni ugh, in recognition of three cases solved. Awesome. Okay. Um, also, I did forget. We still have the Genie Lamp, so we can still make some wishes. So um, let me know what type of wishes you guys would want um, her to complete. So she's going to go ahead and just do this for a few hours. She's honestly already tired. Like, okay, she can go ahead and head home. And she's not having any fun. So why don't we go ahead and what can she do that's fun? Maybe she can go ahead and head to the arcade. I don't say I'm not gonna say that she's gonna head to the arcade with Andrea yet, because I don't think she's like at that step where she wants to um uh like invite him out places, but let's just go ahead and head to the arcade. And honestly, Rhea's not a saint either, y'all. She has been leaving her kid at home like literally all day to just do nothing. So I'm sure that's gonna affect him when he gets older, but I'm gonna stop rambling about that because I think I've said that at least ten times in this single part, but Anywho, let's go ahead. What can she do for fun? Let's have her grab a prize. Maybe she can win a prize for um, Aiden. Let's see. Will she win? Come on, queen. I know you can do it. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh, she got it. Okay. Oh my god, we actually get it. I didn't even know that. That's cool. Okay, so we can definitely put that in the house somewhere. Why don't you go ahead and play Razor Bunny Adventures for a little bit? Her social's kind of low, too, so... Maybe we should talk to some people here. Who's this Missy Little? We know her, so let's go ahead and greet her. And just talk to her so she can get her social up a little. How's Aiden? Um, babysitter, we have a new one. It's Trina Caruso. Interesting. Let's go ahead and talk to Missy Little. We need to make some more friends, honestly. We have some friends, but like, I think I need to make her some for real, for real friends. Let's go ahead, let's ask her about her career. Um, tell her a funny story, like, about how she got cheated on. That's always a fun story to bring up. Get to know her. Oh, she works at the spa. Okay. Um, is there any way here we can get some food? Um, I don't believe so. Okay, so she's just gonna go ahead and head home after this. I think she's honestly scared to take help, take care of Aiden because she feels like she's gonna mess him up, but she already has, so... Maybe we'll invite, um, Alexi over in the next part to see his kid, or... Actually, maybe we'll just wait until his birthday party for when he becomes a kid, because honestly, I do not want to see Alexi's face, but she's going to go ahead and bike home. This is so embarrassing for her, but, you know, she's eco-friendly and she enjoys this, so it's not my fault. And she's home. Cool. Do you have any bills yet? Okay, not yet. Cool. And, uh, oh, okay, looks like she's all done. Yes, obviously. Let's go ahead and just attack him with the claw, tickle him. And maybe, well, no, she's actually really tired. She wants to teach him how to talk anyway, though, so... She actually wants to do stuff with her kid, but, like, I don't know. Something's up with Rhea, y'all. We'll go ahead and put him um, in his crib and go to bed after this, so... Yeah, I think this is where I'm going to end the part, so... Oh, this is a cute little moment. Um, oh, my camera. This is a cute little moment. Okay, I think I need to fix the lighting situation in this house, because it does not look too good. But anywho, um, I hope you guys enjoy this part. Um, make sure to give me some ideas of where you want Rhea's life to move forward. Like I said, this LP is kind of just going with the flow, seeing what the game gives me. And if you guys have any specific ideas you want to see with her, please let me know down below. Hope you guys are... Oh wait, I'm messing up my outro. Anywho, um, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hope you guys are having a great day or night wherever you guys are. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.